Folks, welcome back to the channel. Doug with Stacking Investments here. Uh, this video, I'm going to talk about selling some of my silver to buy some of these, some of these, some of these. As you can see, this is just partial, but some of those, which fit onto those, which you've seen in my videos, to make this right here to sell out at the flea market. Sometimes, uh, if you follow my videos, you know I'm on par to I'm, uh, gathering up the money outside of my business to pay my house off. So I've been selling at the flea market. I'm selling not only coins and silver, but I'm also selling uh, other items that I have. And sometimes when you're trying to raise money, you know, the whole, the whole concept of selling is to, you know, make money so you got to buy stuff to keep the perpetuation going to make money so i got a hold of these uh, d green by odell double green by odell and then a regular it's just the bristles are just all black on this one and that's a these are 36 inch and then i have what are these 18 inch the black bristle and the green bristle a little shorter version i am getting handles my dad just picked up a truckload of these and these along with handles to go with them so i can sell just the broom head itself or i can sell the broom head and handle combination the reason i got the mop heads is because i've been selling if you follow my videos and my flea market videos i purchased about seven or eight hundred of these mop head handles and uh i've been selling them they've been selling really good but i've had a lot of requests for the mop head itself so that they can put on like this so the way i'm selling is mop handle by itself or you can buy the mop head and then the same thing will be well with the mop hand the mop or the broom heads here I'll be selling those individual and uh, or with a handle, but because of the limited supply of handles, I won't be selling handles individually. So, and then I got a hold of these things, which are kind of cool. These were cheap. These are uh, dust, little dusty things, hand dusters. And I got them in four different flavors, blue, a pinkish red, and an orange, along with that bright yellow. Uh, they were cheap, and I can sell those extremely cheap. So, just a little bit update what I'm doing, what I'm doing to raise the funds. Yes, I am selling silver, and I'm investing in items, throwing some of that money, not all, but some of that money in so that I can continue to double my money and, you know, kind of speed up the process on uh, paying off my house. This is how I'm generating revenue. Um, let's step over here to the trailer. I do need to re-up on the handles. And I have plenty of ammo cans that I'm still selling. So, But this, uh, by getting these the mop heads, I can sell the mop heads individually. I can sell the handles individually. Or I can sell it as a complete kit and everything and with having the mop heads on there has uh helped make some sales since people have been requesting the mop heads themselves i have two versions of those but i don't have only have one version i've got this one and then there's a a little shorter the threads on it are shorter and it's kind of a tan color i have both options anyway just giving you an update uh like i said working to uh working to raise the funds to pay the house off and this is part of it just showing you that not everything has not everything to uh stack up on and uh put away it has to be silver and gold you can reinvest into other things as long as you have you know somewhere to go to sell it you know to resell it for me it's the flea market enjoy it uh best part about being at the markets is being with my dad 
we sell on the weekends. I've shown videos on that at the barnyard in Lexington. And then uh, we do that Saturday, Sunday. And then we are also going up to Pickens, South Carolina at the market there to sell on Wednesdays. And uh, the main part about it, the main part is I'm making money to pay the house off. The secondary part of that is being able to spend time with my dad doing things that we both enjoy together and uh you never know when that you know never know when that might be the last time we are planning a trip not sure when end of this month end of may first part of june we are going to go back up and do four markets up in pennsylvania and ohio uh, i will do some videos uh, when that gets close am i worried about uh rolling some of the money from coins that i've sold some of my coins, some of my silver into buying this stuff. No, because this stuff is selling really good. I will get my money back almost in almost no time. And then the profits just add to stacking up for the house funds. And uh, I'm not putting I'm not putting the sale of all the coins, but I'm putting profits and money back as we speak. I'm very close. Um, I did fork out for a truckload of these and I say a truckload a pickup truck uh, eight foot bed with a cap full of the broom heads uh, broom handles and a few other odds and ends so uh, you know I'm putting money away I'm reinvesting a little bit of it and as I sell I put a big proportion back and then I take some of it to reinvest into some of this stuff um, I've had tested out a couple cases of these they come 12 to a case uh, the different colors in each case and they are selling pretty good so i went ahead and got uh 10 cases there's a dozen in a case so that's what i'm doing hope you're doing well hoping you're finding ways to uh supplement your income or you know looking for other ways to uh to make some money so you can either reinvest in back into silver gold whatever it is or uh, buy items that you sell and flip that money into something else you can sell to keep the process going. Free enterprise, that's what it's all about. Uh, people say, oh, I can't do this or I can't do that. You know what, there's so many ways out there to make money. This is just, this is just one of the unlimited ways to uh, make some extra money, put it away. Anyways, I'm gonna let you go. I got to put all this stuff away. I was just sorting through it, getting it out of my truck because I had these things in every nook and cranny within my truck coming home. And uh, I was tired. But uh, that's where I'm at. That's what I'm doing. Yes, I'm still doing heat and air and plumbing. Things are slow right now. And uh, I will catch y'all on another video.